Tonight, a group of young people spoke out publicly about gun violence across our area. The young leaders of today and March for Our Lives, Jacks, gathered together for the Shh, Let the Youth Speak event at the Legends Center. News 4 Jacks reporter Corley Peel is live now to show us what the students think needs to be done to curb gun violence in Jacksonville. Corley? Tonight's event gave students the opportunity to share their concerns and views on gun violence. They believe there is a problem and they want to make sure that they can come up with solutions to help make their community safer. A panel of students sat on a stage at the Legends Center Tuesday sharing their concerns about gun violence among Jacksonville youth. Winston Peel is the vice president of the Young Leaders of Today. He believes there is a problem with gun violence considering he hears gunshots on a regular basis in his neighborhood. When I'm hearing, I want peace to this. I really want peace to this because all this gang related and all this shooting does not have to happen. Students spoke about school safety and their concerns about the possibility of arming teachers. So why would we give a gun and have a teacher who strives to educate, not to protect and serve? Metal detectors in schools were also discussed. Some feel they would take away from the learning environment. Students believe having mentors and organizing group programs can help find solutions to stop gun violence. Moving forward, I feel that um, things that we could hear from what the panelists is giving us tonight, we could take it to City Hall and see if we could have a program um, for these certain things and how, how we could address gun violence and what are the solutions of gun violence. Peel says he just wants to feel safe in his community. Several community members, including JSO officers and city council members, attended tonight's meeting. Coming up tonight at 11, we'll hear from one city council member and what he thinks about the students' concerns. Reporting live, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.